Okay, uh, good day, uh, my dear students. Uh, this uh, day we are going to have our second plate in the geometrical constructions, which is uh, entitled uh, angle or angles. Okay, so the first problem here is, uh, or problem number four is to divide a straight line into a given number of equal parts. Then the second problem is to transfer an angle. And the third problem is to draw a perpendicular line from a point to a given line. So let's start. So as the basic no, uh, process is that you need to divide the drawing plate into two, I mean into six equal parts. So here I'm using zero and eight. So of course, number four no? is the middle. Then, for the vertical, uh, I use 0 and 12. So, this is 4 and 8. Then, you draw vertical lines. And after that, draw a 3mm line for the problem and have a gap of 1mm for the title of the plate and have another uh, guide for a longer title okay so let's start number four Okay, then write the title to divide a straight line into a given number Okay, so as much as possible, uh, use the guidelines properly. The next, to transfer an angle. Okay, then here to draw a 
perpendicular line from a point to a given line Okay, so after that, you are going to make the guidelines for the steps. Okay, so all the lines here in the steps are in 3 mm. Supposing. Okay, so let's focus now on problem number four. So in a where on the drawing, you make line AB, terminate this with the uh, point on both sides. So using your T-square, you draw guidelines for line A and B. And then, from point A, make an angle, not really dark line, uh, a construction line maybe. Then label this as C. Okay. So using your compass, you set a desired measurement, no? And hit. This one, set of measurements equally. Supposing we're going to divide this into five equal parts. Okay, so you label this one. So one. Okay. And now reposition your T square. In this position. Let us look for an angle. This one. Okay, adjust a little bit, this one, no? So this is for five. This is for four. This is for three. This is for So you were able to divide the line, no? Equally, this one, all right. So, if you have made this one, then you were able to solve the problem. Next, anywhere from this area, you're going to make an angle. So let's make this as line AC. 
and B. Okay? So, you need to transfer this angle on this one. So, start with this line. No? Supposing line AC. So, let's make this as line A sub 1 and C sub 1. Now, using your compass, you extend the angle. Position your compass on point A. Strike an arc. And then, use this point. So, let us label this as X and Y. Okay? So, from Y, extend your compass to hit point X. Now, after that, Again, again, no? So here, no? You have made the X and Y. So transfer that in point A. Strike an arc. Okay? Then using your uh, Y as your center, you transfer it here to strike an arc then make it as x1 or x sub 1 and y sub 1 this x sub 1 and y sub 1 connect a sub 1 and y sub 1 okay again so you go, you get first the angle transfer here and then get the uh, use the point Y here and you hit the point of the intersection which is X sub 1 will be the connection of A sub 1 to produce another line to have uh, identical angle no? so if you have done that then you have solved the problem okay the next is to draw a perpendicular line from a point to a given line. So we are going to perform two angles here. One is that uh, the center is outside the line and the other one is when the center is within the line. So let's uh, perform first the, the point. No? within the line so label this as line AB so like for example our center is here within the line so extend or adjust your compass then hit arc within the line and label this as X and Y. Okay, or supposing O and P. So use O and P, extend your compass. Use O and P as your center. Then strike an arc, transfer to P. Strike an arc. This will become supposing this is y okay so use or connect the center and the y so this will be your point x supposing this is your point x so connect x and y to make an angle so to check okay Okay, so you have now made an angle here. Now, another problem is when the point is outside the line. So again, label this as A. This is B. And supposing your X is here. 
okay so when your x is there okay adjust your compass here okay and then you will produce O and P. Use O and P as your center. Adjust your compass to a bigger angle. This one. Transfer to point P. And we'll produce Y. To connect Y and X. Now you have made this problem. You have solved the problem. Okay? Question. If you have the question, then you can proceed now to your work. For clarification, all the steps should be uh, done here. No? So, on how to solve, I was able to give you the demonstration. So again, before you leave, subscribe uh, and like my channel and wait for additional uh, demonstration for the rest of the uh, problems in our geometrical construction. Good day everyone.